Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another tier list. The first one I did was of the Wizarding World movies. So if you guys haven't watched that yet, um, make sure to do that afterwards. But today we are going to tackle the Alien slash Predator franchise. Um, some of the best movies uh, came to be in this franchise, but also some of the worst movies ever created. So, <laughs> this is my ranking of all the Alien slash Predator movies. Um, yeah. Enjoy, and, uh, yeah. Again, watch the Wizarding World tier list if you guys are up for it. Um, we're gonna do this in the correct order, of course. This is the first one, I assume. And the first one, I really, really enjoy. It's good. It's, it's fantastic. Everybody knows that. Um, I was really impressed by how the ship looked, you know, on the reveal, uh, when you f see the ship for the first time. I think it's like a, a, a model or something, a miniature model, but it looked absolutely fantastic. I was actually blown by uh, how that looked. And, um, the practical effects for uh, the aliens itself was absolutely great as well. It was an actor in a, in a suit or something. I don't think it was, uh, they they used CGI for it, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but it everything just looked awesome. Um, of course, uh, when the chest burster bursts out of Ian, uh, John Hurt's chest, sorry. Um, apparently, uh, the actors didn't know that that was going to happen, so their uh, reactions to that was... Uh, real so yeah that was really great it's it's just a great movie it's absolutely fantastic um i love it it's great it's a perfect way to begin the franchise and then we of course have aliens directed by james cameron of course the alien directed by ridley scott um aliens yeah <laughs> it's 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 my favorite movie of all time um Paired with Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. I know, it's it's a weird choice, but anyway. Um, absolutely love everything about Aliens. Um, it's a perfect, like, action flick. The first one was actually more of a horror. Aliens is more of an action flick with all these military people, you know, shooting their guns and stuff and being tough. And, of course, we got the whole plot line with Ridley, uh, Ripley, sorry, and... Uh, Newt, you know, the whole mother and daughter thing, um, which was absolutely uh, adorable and cool and awesome. And Ripley in the mech suit and that sort of stuff. It was just, it, it's just a perfect movie in my opinion. So, um, and then we got Alien 3. <laughs> I was so stoked about this when I, when I did a, um, binge watching thing. I watched all the movies for the first time in a binge. I loved Alien, Aliens even more, and then Alien 3. Oh my god. I was pissed. Um, like, there there are parts in the beginning that I absolutely hated. You know, Killing of Newt was absolutely unforgivable. It just ruins the aliens, the whole point of the Aliens movie, the James Cameron one. Uh, I get it, Carrie Han grew up and, you know, she didn't even want to act anymore, but, uh, they could have just, you know, picked a different actress or something, I don't know, but they killed her off, and then, the worst thing of all, they just created, like, this autopsy scene by showing, like, parts of her face and stuff, they even made an entire, like, doll body thing for Newt, and, uh, uh it was gonna be much more graphic. In the original cut but uh test audiences didn't like that at all so they cut it down thank god um the rest of the movie is just garbage you know the whole prison thing the set looks bland and boring and the characters are just absolutely boring the cgi for the alien oh my god it's just god awful um this is definitely the worst piece of garbage ever created. It's my least favorite movie of all time. It's absolutely garbage. So, then we got Alien Resurrection. The pictures are so little, I can't 
really I think this is it, it, this is this one. <laughs> um I remember liking it. People are are rating this as a comedy. Even Dead Meat, um who does this thing with horror movies where he, you know, shows the kills and that sort of stuff. Um really great channel, Dead Meat. Um definitely recommend watching him. Um he, but he rates this as a comedy. Um I have fun memories of watching it. I, ha I haven't watched it in a while, so I I don't really know where to place this. I really enjoyed it, to be honest. I think I'm going to place it here. Good, but slightly less good than the good rating above. Um, I think that's fair. Uh, then we got Alien Covenant. Um, I remember not liking this movie at all. <laughs> Um, but it's definitely not the worst piece of garbage ever created, so I'm just going to place it here. It's been a while since, since I've seen Alien Covenant, but I remember the scene with Michael Fassbender making out with himself or something. It was just... no. I mean, I'm not that kind of person that hates that sort of stuff, but, you know, it's just... Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> um, Then we move on to Prometheus. I absolutely love Prometheus. Uh, it's a visually stunning movie. I absolutely love all the visual effects in the cave. Um, and of course, we got the meme from CinemaSins uh, out of it. You know, the running away. Prometheus school of running away from things. Which is really funny. <laughs> so, but yeah, I, I like Prometheus. It's a really nice visual uh, experience, in my opinion. So, I'm going to rate it fantastic. I, I really love the movie. Then we move on to Predator, get to the job, yeah. Yeah, my Arnold impression isn't great, so <laughs> sorry. Um, I watched this over the weekend for, I believe, the second time, and I enjoyed it. It's really good. <laughs> so I'm going to place it with uh, Fantastic. It's, it's a fantastic movie. Let's be honest, it's a classic. And then we got Predator 2. Predator 2, I actually saw for the first time this weekend or uh, you know previous week you know what I mean um, I expected absolutely nothing from it because you know sequels tend to be less good than the original with the exception of aliens obviously but I was surprised how good it was um, I'm not sure how I feel about Danny Glover being the hero because I know Danny Glover only from movies where he's like the president or an old man uh you know president in 2012 and then he was the old man in jumanji uh the next level so i don't i never seen denny glover as a like main antagonist you know battling aliens and stuff um so i wasn't really uh keen on that i don't know it worked out pretty well i guess uh and of course, I discovered that Bill Paxton is in the movie as well. Um, he is in Aliens as well, so that was cool. I mean, I know Bill Paxton from my childhood. I absolutely love Spy Kids. He played uh, the Dinkster in Spy Kids 2 and 3. And there's a YouTube channel dedicated to one line that he says in Spy Kids 3. Like, Did somebody ring the Dinkster? Like, that channel uploads <laughs> the same clip every day. It's hilarious. Dinkster Daily. It's funny as hell. <laughs> but anyway, uh, Predator 2, I actually really, really enjoyed it. Um, people seem to be not a big fan of this movie, but I really enjoyed it. Um, yeah. <laughs> it's good. It's not fantastic, but I, I really enjoyed it. So um, That just shows my great taste in movies, I guess. I don't know. Um, and then we have... Uh, uh, which one should I do? Should I uh, Predator Predators, the one with Adrian Bro Adrian Brody. Um, Danny Trejo is in this in this as well. He doesn't live for very long. Uh, spoiler alert! Sorry. Um. Yeah. Um. I, it's it's fine. It's fine. Um. 
I'm gonna place there with good, slightly less than good than a blah, 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 that one. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. Um, I just didn't enjoy it as much. Um, the movie looks a hell of a lot better than the older movies because of special effects and that sort of stuff. But um, I, I, I I enjoy it for what it is, I guess. And then we got The Predator. Um, I've only seen this once, but I really remember enjoying it. So maybe it's just a biased opinion or something from someone who has only watched the movie once. And that was a really long time ago, I believe. I watched it for the first time uh, when it came out on Blu-ray or something. Back in the face where I actually just downloaded movies. Uh, so, um, but I remember liking it. So, I'm going to place it here. And then we got the Alien vs. Predator movies. Um, the first one, I remember loving it. Um, you know, the whole temple underneath the ice with the, like, maze underneath it. Um, I absolutely loved it. Of course, Lance Henriksen is in this movie as well as Bishop, so that's a plus one, I guess. Um, I rated good. Um, again, I haven't seen the movie in years, but I remember liking it. And then we got Alien vs. Predator Requiem. Um, yeah. <laughs> That movie is garbage. I remember the lighting really being really bad. The movie is really, really dark. You can't see what happens. And I honestly don't remember anything of this. Um, I watched it uh, like years ago uh, in a du dual, double feature, whatever. Uh, anyway, it's it's just a garbage movie, but not bad, not not on the same level as Alien Three. So. <laughs> Here is my um, rating of ratings of uh, the Alien slash Predator franchise, with Aliens being the big winner, also being my favorite movie of all time, um, shared with Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. And on Fantastic, we have the first Alien, Prometheus, and Predator. Then we got Good, Predator Two, and Alien vs Predator One. Then Good, but slightly less good than the Good rating above. We got Alien Resurrection, Predator Two, and or Predator, sorry, and The Predator. Then we got Meh, is Alien Covenant, and Predator Requiem. And then we got the worst piece of garbage all of, of all time is Alien 3. That movie can burn in hell. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, yeah, let me know if you guys want to see more tier lists of movies. Um... And I'll uh, get right on that. Of course, the only rule has to be that I actually watched all the movies, which I've done now of this franchise. So, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!